why am I looking that way? Why? Why? Okay. Um, it is January 24th, 2018, day 23, day 23, right? Because I missed the first. But you know what I think I'm going to do? I'm going to do January 1st, 2019 to make up. Okay? <laughs> so anyway, um, my vlog for today is the fact that shit like this happens to me to where I don't know what famous people look like. I guess famous. Um... And sometimes I, I don't know, and I'm like, they could be right in front of me, they could, and I wouldn't know that. That happened to me today. Okay, so for my line of work, I had to go to the city of Austin, because like I said, I'm on the home um, building construction. So I had to go to the home uh, city of Austin to try to get water permits, trying to find out where our building permits are, I need copies of our permits, blah, blah, blah. So I'm sitting in line. No, I'm not. I had to go upstairs. I had to turn in a resubmittal and I'm sitting here waiting for another clerk to come up to me so I can talk to them about the situation that's going on because I think they effed up my permits and I'm trying to clear that shit up. So I'm sitting here. I'm not sitting. I was standing there by the wall because all the seats were full because that's how it is. Like city of Austin that's just a different story anyway standing there and I see this guy coming out of the elevator right and just looking at him I am not that tall I am five foot one maybe <laughs> and I could have sworn like me just looking at him he didn't I, I was almost eye level with the guy but I guess not and it seemed like he was in a hurry he rushed out of the elevator ran that way, came back, did something, ran back again, and then psh, he went. And I just remember the first impression that I got from this guy was like, one, he looks like he doesn't belong here because he looks like he's confused. He looks like he's not sure which direction to be pulled in right now. He's in a hurry. He's following this guy, and then he's not following him. Then he goes back to the guy. His hair was all disheveled. I'm like, don't you need to brush your hair before you... But then I'm like, this is Austin, you know? Who knows? This guy could be a millionaire. He just looks like he rolled out of bed. Whatever. I think he had shorts on. Anyway, I was just like looking at this guy. I don't, I don't know who he is. And the guy he was with started like talking like, oh, you, no, no, no. He got a phone call. He's like, you didn't take a picture with him? You didn't take a picture with him? Oh, man. And then he hangs up. Some other lady goes out there, talks to him. She, he's like, guess what? I guess who I'm working with, da, 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 da. yeah, and I told my daughter, you didn't get a picture with him, and I'm, I don't know what's going on, then I hear him over here, yeah, look, he, he signed my, he got me a check, look at the check, signature, and all that, she's like, oh, you gonna keep it, are you gonna make, frame it, and, no, no, I was like, this is just cool, whatever, I was like, who is this guy talking about, then he goes to talk to this other guy that's next to me, and he's like, yeah, he's on uh, X-Men. He's X-Men. That's who he is, yeah. And I was just like, okay. Again, I, I I, don't know actors. I don't know actresses. I don't, don't know. So he's like, yeah, man, we're doing his, his... I don't even know if he said it, but he, what he said was, yeah, he hired some other contractors. They messed up. They didn't get the permits correct. So he's basically there like cleaning up the mess and he's like yeah you should see him he's a, he's cyclops he's cyclops for the x-men he's on he's a big movie star you should see him he comes on a bunch of movies da, da, da. i'm like who the f are we talking about so i'm on my phone i'm like let's google this guy x-men cyclops and they show me this picture of a clean cut guy and i'm like well i think that was him scroll down and his hair is kind of like it's, it wasn't as full or a grown out I guess it was short but it looked like yeah I was like that is him that's him that's the guy so come to find out his name is James Marsden and so I was like that's the guy I saw so I'm like seriously like I see people I don't know famous people I they could be sitting next to me and be like what's up how's it going and like shit like that always happens to me I don't 
but and then um they're like he's upstairs he's on the fourth floor so if you guys want pictures da, 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 and i'm thinking you really you really shouldn't be saying this you know this guy's and it makes me think okay one he came out of the elevator quick he was back and forth back and forth he didn't look like he knew where he needed to go or he didn't look like one he could have just been in a hurry to be like okay i need to go because he did say the contractor did say that he was leaving on an airplane like in an hour to go back to LA. So he could have been in a hurry, get to the airport, gotta do my shit, no, no, no. And one, I didn't even know he lived here, so that's pretty cool, but I don't know if it was his house or if it was someone else's house that he was fixing. But anyway, I'm like, as a contractor, you probably shouldn't be bragging about this. This is your client, you know? I was like, let's keep him on the DL. He probably doesn't want you to know. He probably even shouldn't be here. He probably had to be here because of this BS happening right now. And then I start thinking, he's on the fourth floor. What's on the fourth floor? I'm like, oh, man. City of Austin loves their trees. <laughs> it's like, he must have tore a tree down, and they're pissed. <laughs> so that is why he's on the fourth floor. I've dealt with people on the fourth floor, and uh, the lady up there, uh, it depends on who you get and what mood they're in. But she's like, you can't do it here. You have to make an appointment. You have to go to the end of the hall and da 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 I'll give you the runaround, right? And so I'm like, well, I wonder if you're famous, if you've got pool, or she's still going to be like, you can't do it. You shouldn't have knocked that tree down. Let me make an appointment so you can get fined. <laughs> you know? But, I mean, situation, like, I went, okay, my son, he loved loved he doesn't love him anymore hollywood undead so we i took him to a concert and i was like okay i know they wear masks and i asked him i said if they if you were to see them or something would you be able to recognize them he's like no they wear masks i said yeah i know so we went to long john silvers is right across the street from the venue we wanted to eat before we went inside so we're just sitting there and i swear to you i'm sitting here and i'm looking at this guy across and I'm just like, I don't know why I feel like I need to know him. I don't know why. I feel like something's happening here. Like there's a connection and it's getting crossed. I don't, I, I, I don't know. Something, it's not, we're not hitting it. But I feel like something's going on. Like he is literally right next to us. And I was talking about my son and all this stuff. And on the way there, I was telling him, hey, if we meet somebody, would you know, you know. Did I say that? Anyway. <laughs> Old. And... Uh, anyway, that guy gets up and leaves. He's he's by himself. He was on his phone. Then he just sat there, and I could see him staring at me. And, you know, I was like, okay. Then he left. We sat and ate, and then we left. We're at the venue. Hollywood Undead gets on stage. Wa -da -da -da, whatever. We're rocking out. All of a sudden, they take their masks off. <laughs> whatever. And then I see the drummer. I went, what? the hell so I told my son I said hey remember when I asked you if we had noticed anybody just standing walking down the street if we'd know them he's like yeah and I said look at the drummer he's like yeah and I said that was the guy that was sitting across from us at Long John Silver's he's like oh, what I'm like yeah yeah we could have met him we could have met him but we didn't <laughs> we didn't do it <laughs> so and then there's another time where I saw uh, the singer of Three Days Grace Adam I think that's his name Adam mm-hmm so uh, the old singer not the new singer but uh, the old singer and I saw I could have sworn I saw him but I wasn't sure like we are in line for the concert and I see him walking like not backstage but walking off to the distance and I see him walking and the only thing that made me think that it was him which is so dumb I mean it was obvious proof but he has a black band tattoo and I could have sworn I saw it but it was kind of dark and I didn't know if it was him or not because he had his jacket and his jacket was pulled up on his you know his arms so I didn't know if that was the band of the jacket or if that was the tattoo but then I was like no it's got it's got things on it I'm like well why would he just be walking out here you know I don't I don't get it and sure enough it was him it was him so mad. It's like when I question myself and things like that, it's like I always miss them. It's like, I'm just not, I'm doomed. I'm not meant to meet them. Anyway, um, that's all I have today. 
that's all exciting things that happened today. I was at the damn city for like half the day. It's like, I go to the city of Austin, and before I go, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna ask him this, gotta get this down, gotta get this down, I'm gonna do, 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 so I'm gonna clear this shit off my list, be done with it, head back to the office, finish up what I have to do, and we'll be done with that mess. That never happens. I always feel like every time I go to the city of Austin, it's another wasted day. Nothing happens. I apparently don't have the right proper paperwork. I didn't sign that. I didn't give them this. And it's, it's like, <sighs> Oh, well, now you need to go back and do this. And it's like, well, you know, I've emailed you five times asking you what I needed and you're not getting back to me. I've called you and left you message after message and you're not getting back to me. So I figure I'll come down here and yeah, I'm trying to avoid me having to come back again and you're just, it's not happening. Yeah, so I need this information. I need this information. Oh, I didn't put it in this spot. <sighs> it's ridiculous. And not only that, but City of Austin, you can only, right, right now we're working with townhomes and a building. And so you can only put five units into one permit. My guys are like, we need these permits now. We need to hurry up and get them. We need them closed by the end of the year, da, 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 da. Okay, so I am finally got an approval, went to go pick them up. This took forever, got them, and yeah, now it's a six unit and the old guy that used to, he, he retired. So the old guy, and I don't mean old guy, but he was my old, he was the original, you know, the old guy. He um, was, he was always on top of it. You know, if there was an issue, click, hey, I don't want to reject you, but if you can get me this real quick, we'll let it slide. Okay, cool, let's do it. And he would tell me, okay, six units, you know, we can only put five to a permit, but we'll divide three and three. Okay, cool. So I get my damn permit back for my sixth unit and they only give me one permit for five. I'm like, Where, where's my sixth unit? Oh, I think we missed that one. So it's my fault now. I have to wait on you because you missed it. Thanks. Thanks. This is just some of the BS we have to deal with in the city of Austin. And I try not to go in there and be mad. I try to be understanding. Okay, I understand you're busy. But shit, get back to somebody, would you? Like, I, I'm, I'm in this just as much as you are. We're all trying to do one thing is get shit done, right? Don't make it any harder than it has to be. That's all I'm saying. But I've dealt with others. Some are more lenient. Others aren't. Uh, City of Leander, you're becoming a, a pain. <laughs> and I think it's because City of Leander just, I mean, it's starting to grow like this and there's not many people that can deal with that that because you it just I think it just crept up on you and you're like oh my gosh you know so you're trying to contain it and and you're making new rules you got to do this you got to do that and it's just coming at you hardcore and now there it's oh you didn't give me this you didn't give me that and I was like what I didn't know I needed that oh okay so I'll go back and do that and oh it's not put put on the paper properly so oh no no so it's because now city of austin and leander are coming together i think <laughs> so separate them we don't need them to be that much of a hassle city of cedar park you're great <laughs> i love working with you i haven't dealt with uh round rock my other co-part has and she said they're easy so thank you but now we've, we're merging, like I said, or the acquisition has happened and the other company that has taken over, they um, have more communities, like it's down in Buda, it's down in Kyle, it's, down, it's the others, and it's, it's more to learn. But I haven't, I wasn't there at our meeting. We had our first, like, meeting, to come together meeting, and I wasn't there. I was at the city of Austin, so I missed it. I didn't see what we were going to learn about and and what roles we're taking on and all that. So it would be interesting to see how all that comes together. But anyway, that's all I have right now. I am finished editing the video I had yesterday. Now I know why I don't edit. It takes forever. I just want to record, put it up, record, put it up. I'm not, I don't care about damn thumbnails. I don't care about 
me making this all no because it's not about me trying to get out there and get exposed it's basically because it's my thing right now i don't care about that maybe later down the road i will but right now it's just for me it's mine to see if i can do this it's my challenge one vlog a, a day you know to upload and and if i get views i get views that's cool but if i don't i'm not gonna no watch my video no i'm not putting that much work into it <laughs> right it's like it's cool, right now it's just for fun. So I'm not gonna tell you like, subscribe, comment below. <laughs> I'm not gonna do all that because if you want to, you can. And, and we'll interact that way. But right now, just cool, keep it simple. And I think they have these things, things monetized. And I, I don't really wanna do that because that's kind of silly. But anyway, I'm sorry you have to see commercials in the middle and beginning and end of this. That's why you need to get YouTube Red. Man, let me tell you about YouTube Red. I, I love it. I watched, let me, I didn't watch YouTube as much as I have, but sometimes there's a video that I want to see or something comes on, catches my, catches my attention. A stupid video or commercial. Commercial at the beginning. I'm like, oh my God. And now they're putting them in the middle. And I'm like, seriously, I just want to watch the damn video. So I tried, it was, a, it was a three month trial, three months, it wasn't 30 days, so that was cool. And it was a three month trial, tried it, and uh, let me tell you, it, it got me hooked. It was so cool to just zoom through video after video after video after, and not have any interruptions. So you got, I would strongly recommend it. It's like nine, no it's not, it's like 1081 or something like that a month. I do it. I, I would highly recommend that because you don't have to worry about all that BS and you can just go through it and I don't know. I haven't had anybody, to, and then you got YouTube Red, so I haven't had anybody tell me that it's not worth it and they hate it. Like, I, you got the YouTube Red or not, the music YouTube. That's The only bad thing that I do, ha that I don't like about it is that I like the fact that I can watch videos or listen to the videos in the background and I can turn my screen off on my phone but sometimes I get an interruption and it'll go it'll just stop and I'm like why did it stop and I have to get back on my phone turn my phone back on and it'll say error occurred restart or whatever I'll get that once in a while and not even once in a while if I turn my screen off and it's more than like I don't know maybe five minutes I'll get that error I don't like that I wish it would just play so I don't know if that's because my screen's off and it's not recognizing it I don't know if something with my connection but that bothers me because sometimes I'll sleep with headphones on listen to music and then it's, it's just dead and I have to have my screen on in order and then it just drains my battery so YouTube can we fix that or is it just me <laughs> I don't know but anyway I would recommend YouTube Red it's cool get it don't have to worry about the commercials and I think for the fifth time me saying this, that's all I have. Okay, I'm really going to end it this time. I'm going to let that video from yesterday upload, and I'll put two at a time. Two at a time, what? All right, that's all I got.